guys, welcome back to another exciting episode of the TOT Podcast. So, babe, what are we talking about today? What's going we on? We are talking about artists or people who can't sing. Oh. Overrated artists. Yikes. So, I know it's going to make a few people mad, but we're going to talk about it. Okay. All right. Where, where <laughs> did you get this list? Like, how so, did you come up with this? So, I've been doing uh, Greatest Vocalists of All Time oh, or yeah, Vocalists yeah, Who okay. Give You Chills. Right. And recently, I did Whitney Houston. Mm. Everybody on the Patreon voted for Whitney Houston. Right. I will always love you. Shout out to my Patreon members. And it had me thinking, who's the opposite of Whitney Houston? <laughs> Mariah Carey. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. But if Mariah Carey can sing, though. Yeah, but I don't think she's the opposite. Really? No. Well, then who do you think is the opposite? J-Lo. And speaking of J-Lo. <laughs> what do you mean? J-Lo as far as being able to match? Uh, no, who can't sing. Oh, who can't Who's sing? the oh, opposite? Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. J-Lo is one of those artists <laughs> who I never, like, she has good songs. She does she have good songs. She has good songs, but yes. she's never been one of those artists who I've really, like, focused on her vo voice to really judge mm -hmm. if she can sing or not. Yeah. But now that I think about it, you know, her <laughs> songs are like party songs or club yeah. songs. And so I'm thinking that they probably use auto-tune with it. Um, here's the thing about J-Lo, because uh, I love some of her songs. She has really good writers, and she's an excellent performer. Mm. She's a, da a great dancer. Um, her vocals have improved over time okay. so she's on my list she's mm. she's top on my list and uh i want to know what y'all have to say but i'm gonna keep going with with this list i know okay. i probably left some people out but this right, is now who, did you compile this list from artists that you that you like or that you can think of in your mind just what first came to mind who can't sing okay right yeah <laughs> but you know they still have careers and yeah. sometimes uh, you being a performer can make up for the lack of vocals. Okay. You know? Right. Yeah. yeah. So next up on my list, speaking of a great performer, Madonna. Madonna? <laughs> Madonna, I don't think she can sing. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Huh. Now she could dance. See, and this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's the same thing with J-Lo. With pop stars, it's really hard to tell if some of these stars can sing. Nah, it ain't hard because, to tell. Well, the thing of it is, <laughs> no, it's like the, a lot of times with pop music, the music is so catchy and yeah. the dancing and everything. You get and distracted. And so the person is a good performer, <laughs> but you really can't tell if they sing or not. So although she has good songs, yeah. I've never really heard a song from her that really would like push her range. Yeah. Uh, say, for instance, for someone like Whitney Houston mm -hmm. or Mariah Carey, where mm -hmm. you can say, wow, that's a powerful song. Right. You know, they're hitting all these notes, but with, Madon Ma with Madonna, they're just kind of like pop songs. So I never really thought of her as being a, a great singer, yeah. but she's a great performer. Yeah, and so if you really don't think, wow, what a singer, or wow, she got some pipes on her, like even Celine Dion mm. is like, then yeah. they're not okay. really that great of a singer. <laughs> right, right. And I mean, it's okay. Um, we're in the world of not too good singers anymore now, uh, you know, uh. and that's what a lot of people are complaining about. Like, when we do these reactions, you know, a lot of people say, oh, I miss this kind of music or I miss, okay, right. I miss this, that, or the third because... Back then, you really had right. talent. That's there what they say. Back in my day, yeah. everyone was talented. But, you had to have talent to, to make right. music. Right, because now we have machines that can, you know, manufacture artists. Ooh, you yikes. know, just little auto-tune, some makeup, some yeah. smoke and mirrors, and voila, a pop star. You know they have a <laughs> uh, like a computer algorithm that actually writes the lyrics to songs? And so, yeah, so what what they'll do what? is they'll put, the, they'll put the lyrics in for, like, the top... 20 popular songs of all time or whatever uh -huh. and the computers will analyze the lyrics <laughs> and then it'll compile a song what yeah yeah oh, we'll i to, need to yeah, see we'll this we'll have to do a video on it maybe but, it can make me a song yeah, i'm pretty sure it can <laughs> uh but anyway what's who's next on your list kesha kesha okay i don't i don't know who that is okay i do remember she was involved with TikTok the incident with uh jerry seinfeld yeah oh see that's bad right but see, I, if you but, know a artist by an embarrassing moment and not their song <laughs> that just proves that okay. they're not really that great of a singer All right, well. but she had the song TikTok on the clock TikTok nah. on the clock, 
No, <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, Kesha. <laughs> okay, all right. Who's next? Adam Levine. Now who he's is from that? Maroon Five, and he's on The Voice. Oh, he's on. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the guy from Maroon Five. Ah, I, I, I thought he could sing. I mean, all right. Well, look, look, look. I'm not familiar with Maroon Five or Adam Levine's work he has except for that move song, like Jagger. The moves like Jagger song. See, uh, but when what, he sings live, he sounds like a little a little rat to me. See, all right, check it out. <laughs> well, see, this is the thing, as I said before, with pop artists. With pop artists, it's really hard to tell if they can sing or not because most of the time they're doing pop music or pop songs You can that are sing pop and still sing. You can, but most pop artists, they're doing songs that are catchy. They're fun to listen to. They have yeah. a really cool chorus. Mm -hmm. And what I'm coming to find is that um, – they like to slightly use auto tune mm -hmm. in a lot of their music, and yeah. sometimes you can't really tell unless you listen to it. Because <laughs> when I think about Adam Levine, I think about Maroon Five. I think about the hit song that broke them out, uh, where it was like this time, da, 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 da. and that's the only thing I can think of. But in my mind, it don't judge it, us it, for our singing. Though. Well, <laughs> yeah, because I can't sing. But in my mind, it sounds good. But I can't actually think of it as like testing wow. the range of his voice. Yeah, like, wow, this right. is a really good singer. Because, like, pop singers, uh, even in the 90s, were pretty good. You had Michael Jackson. You had yeah. Celine Dion, who is a pop artist. Um, you really? Had, I think so. Okay. She had popular songs. Whitney right. Houston, Mariah Carey. See, but, Those but, were the pop stars right. but a lot of, of the 90s, yes. and, and they could really sing. Right, and that's what's interesting, because those artists from in the 90s, they all also had ballads, and mm. the ballads were the songs yeah. that would allow you to show off your vocal range. Right. And there was a lot of rockers out there as well, a lot of rock artists. They always would have ballads within mm. their, you know, their screaming catalog. or within yeah. their catalog yeah. or whatever. That way you could actually hear that these guys have range, they, they got mm -hmm. a voice, and they have some serious pipes. Right. So next up on the list is... Jason Derulo. <laughs> <laughs> so, to me, you know, because I'm not a fan of Jason Derulo's music, I've me never neither. really listened to it. That's but, all I know. Uh, um, I can't even name a song. For, for the songs that I have heard, uh, or heard in snippets, he comes off to me as kind of like a pop a and R&B kind of uh, singer. Mm -hmm. So, um, so yeah. He's auto-tuned. He's auto-tuned? Yeah. Oh, yeah. man. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah. See, and it's, that's what's interesting. It seems like autotune was the music industry's secret weapon. until because yes, they don't care about the music or right. anything like that. It's about money, baby. Right. That's well, that, all it's about now. It's a money-making like. machine. Cause yeah. Like, even somebody who uh, people will think belong on this list, Britney Spears, Britney can actually sing. Oh, yeah. They made sing. her change her voice. Right. And so my thing is, I think they should bring back talent. Mm. Well, they 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 try with oh. shows like American Idol. Oh yeah, because then you have see, but this is the conundrum that we're in because people say that they want talented singers, mm. and we watch shows like American Idol where there's actually people who can yeah. really really and do they sing. Win? No, well, they don't well, win. Kelly Clarkson, she won. That right. girl can sing, right. and so but did. But the issue uh, is, the issue is, it's not about the talent. And, uh, well, I guess in American music, American pop music, it's not about the talent, but it's what it looks like. And it's what oh, it can yeah. be branded as. Mm -hmm. If you look good, if you can dance, yeah. then we can repackage you and we mm -hmm. can throw some auto-tune on there and we can make some money off of you. Right. And so you you really kind of have to have the package in order to be able to... And that's why we don't have mm -hmm. the talent that we have because right. you have to look a certain way in order to right. be a pop star nowadays like you don't well, need right. the voice yeah absolutely. you don't need all of these things that back in the day you had to have yeah well it seems like and that's mainly because nowadays music is just pop music it's mm -hmm. pop rock it's pop rap Hey. It's pop R and B and and so I, I must say I'm guilty of it but but the people I like 
who are pop stars can actually sing, like mm -hmm. Ariana Grande. I know a lot of people don't like her, but Ariana can sing. She's very talented. Yeah. You cannot deny that. Now, th that's the thing. Like, you might not like this artist, but then you can't deny the talent. Yeah. Also, Christina Aguilera. Okay. She is another person who was a pop star who can right. sing. Yeah. And, Great vocal range. Yeah, definitely. Right. So, yeah. Um, so guys, yeah, leave your thoughts yeah. down below in the comment section. We want to know who do you think belongs cannot, on. yeah, who you think belongs on this list. Who who are your choices for singers that and artists that cannot sing. sing? We would love to hear those choices. So leave them down below in the comment section. As always, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and uh, we'll see you in our next video. Ta ta. Peace. <laughs>